Hi guys, welcome back to Let's Play Dreamfall. We left off in a very tense and action-y scenario uh, just a second ago where this person is trapped. Let's help them. But, hi, can I help? The doors are jammed and the circuitry has been EMP'd. Well, break it open. Look up. Look up. I should be able to climb up there. So do it. Okay, so we lock one person into a room and we're trying to free another one from a different room. Oh, we're gonna jump in? Why are we jumping in? To a locked We're gonna jump into a locked elevator oh no we're not, okay. I the cover's loose. I should be able to open it. Good. Do so please. If you would be most kind. There's a handle with a label that says pressure release. Just what we were looking for. Excellent! Jump down now. Jump. Jump. Well, I... Wait, I did what I meant to, right? Yeah? No! No! Wrong! Zoe! Zoe! This is no time to be screwing around. Get down. Open. Thank God. The gas was starting to leak through. Another few minutes. What just happened? Who are those people? This is neither the place nor the time for explanations. We need to leave now. Yeah, let's do that. Wait, what about the package? We did not take the package. Where's the package? We need... No, package! Should we let her out? That sounds like a bad idea, doesn't it? But... She won't get out on her own. I sure hope she isn't a real receptionist. Or I'm in serious trouble. Right, there's that. Someone's tampered with the system and blocked all access to this floor. I'll need to find a workaround. Great. Let's use the vending machine electronics, yes? I've reactivated the manual override. Okay. Try the call button for the elevator. It should work now. It's the call button. Quickly, get into the elevator. We can't stay here any longer. Excellent. Mission accomplished. Or I probably owe you my thanks for saving my life. I, I wasn't really thinking. I... Look at me, I'm shaking. That's just the adrenaline. It's perfectly normal. Not for me. It's not every day that someone tries to kill me. They weren't trying to kill you. They were trying to kill me. Now, who are you? And what were you doing in my laboratory? I'm Zoe Castillo. Are you Helena Chang? That's not... Castillo. I see. Yes. Yes, I'm Helena Chang. How do you know my name? I came by to pick up a package for a friend of mine, Jericho. Jericho? I told him I wouldn't give the package to anyone but him. He couldn't make it. Didn't he tell you? I never got that message. Maybe it was intercepted. That would explain a lot. Look, I don't like this. Those people who tried to... to kill you. Are they looking for... for Jericho too? I wouldn't know. But I need to leave right now. Here, take this. Please deliver it to Jericho as it's soon as It's the package. Possible. What is it? Information. He'll know what to do with it. She acted a bit strange when I told her my name. What's in that package? Hmm, I think I'm a little bit more interested in the package. What kind of information? I'm sorry, but that's really none of your business. The package is for Jericho's eyes only. I have to leave. Wait, I need to ask you... Please deliver the package to Jericho right away. And thanks again for your help. I shall not forget it. Zoe Castillo. Ah, uh, so I should hey, have asked wait. about the name. Come back! Damn it. Reza has some serious explaining to do. Yes, he does. It's... 
uh, hmm, no driver. That's safe. Okay, let's go to his apartment. Wait, did I? Right. This way. Loading screens galore. Ooh, excuse me while I yawn. I'm getting a little sleepy. Okay, wait for the computer to catch up. Catch up. Are you okay? Wait. Alright, good. You're good now? You're good? Ugh, I thought I turned down the system volume. I did turn the system volume down. You are not supposed to hear that because I am encoding all the videos ready for uploading. And you know what? I just don't want to hear any complaining about it at all because that is the sound that you all and I have to endure um, to make these videos possible. So, no complaining. We know exactly where it is because we've been here before. Mmm. <laughs> kind of in the mood for salsa. Salsa. Wait, wait, it was this side. Okay, it was this side. Oh! <gasps> hey, little kitty. Oh, hello. <gasps> kitty, hello. Don't jump out the window. Don't do it. Why's you have door? so much to live for. And why is the door to his apartment open? Interesting. Cat is gone. Okay. Reza's apartment. Yeah, clearly. Oh, it's one of those creepy bots Reza? again. Reza. The door just closed behind her. He never leaves the apartment unlocked. This is weird. Hey, nice apartment. Oh. <gasps> God. Oh God, dead You're person. Okay. Oh. She's cold. That means she's dead, Zoe. Oh. Hmm. Oh no, not again. What the hell is going on? Find April. Save April. <gasps> so Those creepy. Are <gasps> oh no, 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 we got to get out of here! Wait, 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 gotta get out of here. What is that? Pick it up. I'm not touching it. What is it? What the hell is that thing? I just said that. Alright, we got to <gasps> Oh no! We gotta get out of here, we gotta leave! Zoe! Oh dear. Oh dear. We didn't get out fast enough. Are we gonna die? Go, go, go! Hands behind your head! Listen, I, I warned you. That's lovely. Apparently they have a one warning policy. Put your hands up. But I... Bam. Stunned. Stunned, I assume. State your name and CID number for the record. What is this place? Who are you? State your name and CID number for the record. Cooperate. I shouldn't play with fire. Or counteract. I ju I'm just going to lawyer up. Um, what do you think, guys? Should we oppose the system? The system seems, um, fine to me right now. I shouldn't play with fire. Um, I, 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 uh... I'm getting the feeling that we're going to need to oppose this, s eventually oppose the system, so let's counteract now. A lawyer. Name and CID number now. I was scanned when I was brought in. You know who I am. You're being held under the Syndicate Anti-Corporate Activities Statute in connection with murder and possession of contraband software. I would strongly suggest that you cooperate in every way possible, or face the consequences. You guys shot me. Isn't that a violation of my rights as a citizen? As of this moment, Miss Castillo, you have no rights. What were you doing in Mr. Tamiz's apartment? Oh, we're definitely not going to tell the truth. I just came by to say hello, and noticed that the door was open. I walked in, saw the body. Next thing I know, the cops boom me. So where did you get the data cube? What data cube? I will remind you that your freedom is in the balance, Miss Castillo. We have enough to convict you on several counts. 
You could be facing up to 30 years in a corporate prison, or you could choose to cooperate. I doubt that very I'm much. I'm cooperating here. I honestly don't know anything about a data cube. A data cube was found in your possession, containing highly sensitive information. Are you sure it's wise to keep denying your involvement? I don't... Look, I was carrying a package. Someone gave it to me. I was supposed to deliver it to Reza, but he didn't know about it. I don't understand what... Who was the package from? A woman who works at a company downtown. Jeeva. Her name was... Chang, I think. Helena Chang. How did Chang get in touch with you? What? If your friend Mr. Tamiz knew nothing about this, how did Chang contact you? Look. Okay, so I was helping Reza out. He asked me to pick up the package for him. Way to but sell out your friends. He never saw it. Whatever was inside, the only person responsible is Helena Chang. You should be interrogating her. All Reza did was talk to the woman. He's working on a story, and she's a source. What kind of story? I don't know. He didn't tell me. Plead. I need to make him understand that I had nothing to do with this. Or... Reason. I'm sure he'll understand if I just reason with him. Um, plead or reason? Please, you have to believe me. I don't know what's going on. I was just in the wrong place at the wrong time. Yes, you were. We know that you had nothing to do with the murder, but that doesn't clear you from the charges. You are to remain in Casablanca for the time being. If Mr. Tamiz attempts to contact you, you are to call us immediately. Now, tell us again, from the top, what did Mr. Tamiz ask you to do for him? Well... Hmm. Hi, this is Reza. I'm either busy or I'm sleeping. Either way, let me know what's up and I'll call you right back. Thanks. Um, hi. It's me. Your... your mobile has probably been switched off for, uh, for obvious reasons, but if you do get this message... Reza, um, please, please come home. I'm sure things can be sorted out if you just come home. I'm really worried. Call me, okay? Bye. Or send me a message, just ugh, something, anything. Bye. Come on, Dad, please pick up, please pick... Hello, Zoe. Dad? Uh, I'm sorry, but I'm currently away from my phone. Leave me a message and I'll call you back as soon as I can. Shit. Okay, so, man, I wish that I could access that little book icon right there that appears to be trying to tell me something important. I should clean up that mess at some point. Yes, you should. I've spent so much time on that thing lately, it's a wonder my butt hasn't ballooned. What? Oh, okay, is that significant in any way? Zoe, hmm. there's a message. Hey Zoe, um, this is sort of awkward. Bonkers, I don't have time to... But remember the time we hopped the back tracks to Europolis without telling anyone? And you got completely shit-faced? <laughs> oh, wow. What? I had to carry you to that sleazy hotel down on Yarl Street, and you spent half the night throwing up. Oh, okay. The next morning, you bought me that antique lighter. Remember? Apparently, Reza you know, has this hacked. This is Reza. I um modified Wonkers a bit to make him play a pre-recorded message in case something happened to me. I don't want you to worry. All this means is that I haven't checked in with him for 24 hours. I'm probably okay. However, in case something has happened, I need you to do me a favor. I keep an updated copy of my notebook in my apartment at all times. It contains everything about the story I'm currently working on. I wire over my notes and research twice a day. I need you to get that notebook now 
and take it somewhere safe. If I'm... if I'm in trouble, get the information inside to my editor. You'll need to decrypt it first, so talk to you-know-who. She can take care of that, I'm sure. To find the notebook, I keep it somewhere safe. Go to my apartment and tell Lucia what I told you the day you left for Cape Town. She will find the notebook for you. I'll be here when you come back. Jesus, Reza. Please be okay. Like I said earlier, I'm probably okay. Maybe I just forgot to check in. Maybe Wonkers has malfunctioned. Maybe... Uh, maybe I just had to leave. Quickly. But get the notebook, just in case. You're the only person I can trust with this, Zoe. Keep it safe, and I'll see you soon, okay? Alright. So, uh, I think that about takes up all of our time now. So, we're gonna ha go ahead and end this here. Uh, might do one more after this. Not sure. So, we'll see you next time, viewers, on Let's Play Dreamfall.